Hello Aquarius, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Aquarius, this is your reading for the month of May. You can consider this as a mid-month reading. Uh, this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Okay, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe. And comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. Aquarius, as far as this reading on YouTube is concerned, we'll see what is your energy. What is the energy of the person you're thinking about, you're dealing with or you will be dealing with. Also remember that there is an extended reading. The link for the extended is in description box and comment section. In the extended reading, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. I'll also pull out some oracle cards with the help of oracle cards. Uh, we'll see what are the messages from universe and from higher powers, right? Okay. Link is in description box and comment section. Coming back to this reading on YouTube, let me shuffle the cards, I'll lay them down and then we'll discuss the energies. So we have Empress for you, Eight of Pentacles, Four of Wands and Seven of Cups. As far as your person is concerned, as far as your person is concerned, Aquarius, as far as your person is concerned, Five of Wands, Nine of Cups, The Devil, Three of Swords and this card also wants to come out. We have Ten of Wands. Okay. You may be dealing with a Libra. You may be dealing with a Capricorn. You may be dealing with uh, another Aquarius. Scorpio. Aries. Virgo. If the sign pops up all the better let's not remain fixed on the signs okay so this is your spread we have empress eight of pentacles four of four of wands and seven of cups okay this is your spread hmm you may be seeing a lot of 333, 444, uh, 999, 1111. You may be seeing a lot of 555. Okay. Also, I, I think uh, spirit is trying to convey you certain messages through songs or through dreams or someone is trying to connect with your soul and they are trying to convey the messages through songs or, to, or through dreams most likely through songs right Aquarius hmm So, there is a lot of uh, willingness to put a lot of hard work towards something, 
Aquarius. You are working really hard towards certain things. You feel like the play time is over, break time is over, or uh, there is there is a feeling that I need to bring I need to bring my focus back on the things that matter the most. Okay. And why why there is this feeling that you want to bring your focus back is because you want to build up something, you want to create something and whatever you want to build, whatever you want to create, that is probably getting delayed because of certain temptations, certain uh, obstacles or temptations okay and you are like no enough enough of play time now let me get back let me focus back look at this eight of pentacles this person is so laser focused on this one pentacle okay and his pentacles are growing this person has isolated can you see the buildings behind okay so this person has isolated himself from rest of the world and this person is focused on building and sh uh, shaping reshaping his pentacles his financial situation an empress represents abundance giving birth to something creating something okay you are creating something which will lead to massive abundance okay and in between you felt like you got distracted there was an energy of distraction like you got confused i you probably thought that you need to reshuffle your priorities but then you quickly realizing now that you need to uh, go back you need to focus on things uh, that you were focusing on in the past. As far as romantic interests are concerned, yes, there are people who are watching you, not just watching you. They are, there are people who are a bit obsessed with you. They think of you as a future wife or future husband. Someone has this intention to marry you. They want to have a family with you. Okay. But this person also thinks that you are out of their league. This person also thinks that you are a, you are an amazing person. And at any given point of time, Aquarius, you will have a lot of people interested in you. Okay. Maybe you, you have that... Uh, People, you may have observed uh, uh, Aquarius that people tend to become sexually attracted towards you very fast. Okay. Like they do talk behind you like how sexy and hot you are. Uh, that's the kind of energy I'm getting with this Empress card. Okay. People, people do talk about you, about your, about your beauty, about your hotness quotient. Okay. Whether you're a male or a female watching this, people do talk about you regarding how good looking you are and how uh, sexy you are, okay? And there is this one person who is interested in you, but this person at the moment, they are a bit scared to come towards you. I believe Aquarius, you are no more chasing love. Okay, you are like, I don't want to chase love. Enough of chasing love and enough of uh, making love as, a as an all-time priority. Okay, you have also realized that there are other priorities as well in your life. And you need to give importance to those things as per the situation. Okay. You cannot keep on giving, you cannot keep on making one single thing as an, as a lifelong priority, okay? 
that priorities they need to change as per the demand of the situation okay and maybe you made love and romance or may, you made your previous romantic partners as an all time priority in your life okay and uh, you have realized that you need to focus on on couple of other things as well you're focusing on lot of things especially money is at the top of your mind success is at the top of your mind you probably are aquarius you know what you you are someone who usually don't like to remain in spotlight okay you become uncomfortable or you become you start getting that awkward feeling if you become if you are in the spotlight or if you become the highlight of the highlight of the conversation or uh, you you start feeling awkwardness but i believe this this was a thing of past I believe you are trying to change your perception around that. You are feeling like it's okay if you are in the spotlight. Accept that. It's okay if you are a highlight uh of in the con- you are the highlight in the in the conversation or uh you are the center of attraction in the room. It is okay. maybe you are a very self conscious person or you were very self conscious person in the past okay and you used to hate uh becoming the attraction or uh, becoming the spotlight uh, in the situation you you used to hate that in the past or you used to become extremely uncomfortable when people were trying to make you as the center of attraction however you are realizing that it is okay and absolutely normal that if if you if the focus is on you if the if the spotlight is on you it's okay okay so you are sort of uh, your perceptions are changing your confidence levels are increasing and somehow i'm also getting a feeling like you are working really hard but you are working hard behind the behind the curtains and nobody knows how hard you are working okay and you are like i you want to experience that reward kind of a feeling appreciation kind of a feeling acknowledgement kind of a feeling aquarius that's what i'm getting with with the 4 of wands and 8 of pentacles next to one another and also 7 of cups you you want to experience awards and rewards and you sometimes you feel like it is my, because of my own awkwardness or because of my own shy attitude or introvertedness probably people also thought that they should not be making me the spotlight or should not give me the credit because of my shy attitude or me hating the spotlight or attention okay so you probably are thinking that the world should know now now why why this thought process is running that you should stop becoming shy and you should stop becoming awkward uh, why that why this thought process is there because aquarius you feel like you are working really hard you are doing a lot of hard work but the kind of appreciation acknowledgement that should come your way somehow you feel like that is not coming and now you are thinking that you should be more open to certain things be be more open to become uh you know if it's it's okay if you are the spotlight if you are in the spotlight or if uh if you get the attention from other people that's okay that will only sort of push you towards the awards and the appreciation or the recognition that you want for yourself so there is also a change in perception and probably i also feel like you're a bit tired of isolation you're a bit tired of staying away uh from uh, people or staying away from public working environment uh, you're uh, you're a bit tired of that you want to uh, not that you're a social animal you may be a social animal but i feel you don't want to work alone now you if you're doing certain things uh, if you if you are into a business and doing all alone 
maybe you're contemplating about hiring employees under you okay if you are into uh I also, I also feel Aquarius that you have this knack of teaching people, you want to get into coaching, you like uh, sharing knowledge, you like uh, giving away uh, whatever you have, whatever talent and whatever skills you have, you want to share that with the world. So you, you also are thinking of becoming a part-time teacher, part-time coach or something like that. You probably are also contemplating around sharing your knowledge with the world through social medias maybe a youtube channel or maybe uh, writing a blog or maybe you just want to become a speaker maybe you want to start a podcast or something like that there is an urge where you want to share something to the world okay you are someone who believes in marriage a lot you do believe in marriage institution you have not lost the faith in marriage institution you have not lost the faith in love but somehow i feel aquarius that you are no more chasing love you're like whenever love is meant to happen it will happen i'm not going to chase love and i'm not going to stop living my life for that okay i've chased love more than enough in the past and now i don't want to keep on chasing love all the time in my life i also want to experience other things okay as far as your person is concerned five of wands nine of cups the devil three of swords and ten of wands okay so there is someone who is extremely hurt aquarius I'll be I'll be a bit honest to uh, honest over here. I'm getting the energy of a new person also, and I'm getting the energy of a past person also. If this is a new person, they are out of a connection right now, and they f that the separation was very painful for them. Okay, probably it was a long term situation. Probably they got divorced, and they are out of that connection. Okay, and if this is not a new person, this is a past person, and they are. They are too much in pain thinking about you. They are regretting their past actions. Okay. And they are they are feeling the pain about the fact that they caused, inflicted a lot of pain on you. You are a wish fulfillment for many people. Okay. Whenever people think of you, they they always feel like you are a uh, you are a you you are a husband material or a wife material kind of a person, okay? Uh, and especially whenever your prospective uh, say for example if if you're meeting people uh, for their for. <laughs> For romantic reasons or if you meet people for because you want to go out on dates with them okay the the kind of conclusion the other person draws about you that is usually that they they think of you as as a husband material or a wife material person okay so people who who don't want to become serious they usually withdraw from from after the first date or the second date itself okay because they realize that they don't want, they don't want to hurt your intentions i see you're going to go out on multiple dates okay and uh, you will see a couple of dates not working out i'm i'm hearing that four to five dates will not work out because people they themselves they are going to withdraw from uh, they will withdraw they they will start thinking like you are a very holy and a pure soul you are a husband material a wife material kind of a person and they are not very sure about their intentions so they will withdraw from that situation thinking that they don't want to end up hurting you especially when they are not sure about their intentions okay so the dates that will work out be assured that be assured that the person is also equally serious about relationship and marriage 
if they decide to proceed with further dates or if they decide to proceed with a connection with you okay but i have the kind of energy i'm getting over here is your previous partners after breaking up with you aquarius they have cried a lot they have cried a lot they they had huge regrets that they mistreated you and they did not give their best otherwise this could have been the best possible scenario okay like the future would have been totally different and uh, things would have been totally different all of your previous partners they they had huge regrets after after separation after breakups okay all right uh so there is a new person also there is an old person also and currently this person is going through some pain but they will come towards you they need to heal themselves first uh, first they will they need to heal themselves and then they will come towards you and this person is a wish fulfillment so don't dismiss this person right away if you think that they are not in a good state of mind make efforts to know this person well and then take a call okay all right i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment on below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person okay bye bye then